Male infertility is, is actually more common than, than most people think. Um, when a couple's trying to conceive and, and are, are having trouble, uh, a lot of the time the tension is directed towards the female and whether there's any issue uh, with the woman. But uh, male infertility can, can attribute to you know, up to 40% of the cases, so it's not uncommon. There are a variety of different reasons. Uh, a common one is anything that causes essentially a stress pattern to the, the sperm, number of sperm, the quality of sperm. A varicocele is a common diagnosis that we make for men. This is essentially varicose veins or dilated veins of the testicle that affect the quality of the sperm and it's treatable and can be reversible. So we, we have surgery that we can perform for a varicocele and ultimately make improvements and see improvements there. Some other causes relate to obstruction of the vas deferens or the sperm flow tracts. And so patients who've had a prior hernia surgery, uh, perhaps an injury to the lower urinary tract can develop scar tissue that causes obstruction and an inability for sperm uh, to get where it needs to go. And so we can diagnose and treat that as well. Um, and then there's some other uh, causes that may be hereditary. They may relate to prior trauma infections. Uh, and we have some ways to evaluate that and, and offer treatments there as well.